Hey Taurus, welcome to a bonus love reading. This is going to be a how they feel about you bonus love reading. We're going to be looking at what your person is currently thinking or feeling about you or the connection and what are their intentions or next actions towards you. As always, these readings are meant to be general. So take what resonates for you, what applies to you and leave the rest. You can also check out your other placements, your moon, your rising sign or any other sign of significance. I forgot that I can't do that with this. <laughs> or any other sign of significance for you. All of the playlists are linked in the description box, so that way you can check out your moon, your rising sign, and see if it resonates more for you, because sometimes that does happen. All right, for Taurus, spirits, angels, guides, what do we need to know for Taurus regarding their person at this time? What is their person thinking or feeling about Taurus? What are they thinking or feeling about Taurus? What are they thinking or feeling about Taurus? The Tower Reverse, Two of Cups Reverse, and the Knight of Swords. Okay, so some sort of truth or message here that they're thinking about. Uh, separation, perhaps, with the Two of Cups Reverse. What is up with Taurus? Taurus, I feel like every time that I want... <laughs> I'm using a whole different deck today that I haven't even used for any of the other signs, specifically for you. And I still think that it's the same message that we've gotten before. Eight of Pentacles reverse at the bottom of the deck. No, Seven of Pentacles reverse, my bad. Seven of Pentacles reverse at the bottom of the deck. So I feel like there's someone in your life that wants to talk to you, tell you some sort of message. But when it comes to love or a partnership, there's already a separation or already something that's not so great. The tower is reverse. I'm wondering if this is someone trying to avoid a tower. Maybe they're trying to avoid this separation from happening. But with the Seven of Pentacles reverse, I'm getting someone that's like thinking this was a waste of time, a waste of effort. This will not pan out, you know, almost like self-defeating. So let's see, can we get some more guidance messages, energies regarding this person? Um, I think in their mind, there's no hope for uh, a good outcome, but maybe they're gonna try anyway. What else do we need to know about this person? What else do we need to know about this person? and their thoughts, feelings towards Taurus. Curious, interested and inquisitive. Transformation, metamorphosis and renewal. Considerate, thoughtful and generous and the budding romance energy. Let me look at these two back here. Looking inward and mysterious, enigmatic, mystifying. This person has no idea how you feel or what you're, what's in your mind right now. But I don't know why. Maybe because it's already over and you're, you stop talking to them, or this is someone new that just can't figure it, they can't figure you out, Taurus. Curious. I think they wanna um, reignite something here. But again, in their mind, I don't think either they know how you feel about that idea. It's really strange energy. Let's see. Let's clarify and see what we got. Four Taurus. They might give you a gift. <clears throat> At the very least, they're going to talk to you or they want to talk to you with the Knight of Swords. Yeah, there's a page of swords that just came out. At the very least, they want to talk to you. So let's get into this. And with budding romance, I'm getting almost like, yeah, they want to talk. I'm getting almost that they want to talk in order to start over, to have a change in this connection. But they're curious about what you're going to think about that. You know, I don't, I don't think they know your reaction or what it's going to be. Tell me about this tower reverse. Why is the tower reverse? The chariot, cancer energy, death, Scorpio energy, knight of swords. Yeah, I think... Um, Knight of Cups at the bottom. I think that either you are making some sort of move, leaving a connection. Maybe they left a connection. Someone's moving forward or wanting to move forward and end things, perhaps, um, or change their path, you know, choose a different path altogether. And I think someone's going to try to come in and talk them out of it or talk to them about this. And it's like, let's talk things out. I apologize. Knight of Cups. I love you. Whatever the case may be. Um, it's like someone's trying to avoid this tower, but 
you know, and, and again, I don't know where you fit in this Taurus, but this is from your person's perspective. So I think almost like they are picturing you leaving. Why is the two of cups reverse? Why is the two of cups reverse? The hermit, Virgo energy, the magician and the nine of wands. Once again, um, I think what, yeah, there's a seven of wands. I think there's a wall in front of your person where they can't see into you. They wonder, they may have theories, but they don't really know what you're going to do. I think it scares them because they don't know what to predict. Maybe they can sense a change in you. Maybe they can sense a, a change, you know, in, in, in what the future could be almost. And I feel like with the Seven of Wands and the Nine of Wands here, it's like you don't want them to know. I don't know what this is about, Taurus. If this is resonating for you, please let me know in the comments because I feel like this is for someone. But for some reason, it's not... I don't, I don't see that this person is on the same page with you. I, you're, you're very, like, separated. There's a disconnect that has happened here. Five of Pentacles, the Strength card, Leo Energy, and the Ten of Swords. Exactly. It's like someone's trying to keep the glue here together on something that has already been broken. Tell me about this Knight of Swords. Why is the Knight of Swords here? Why is the Knight of Swords here? Judgment? Oh yeah, this is someone wanting a second chance or a revival. Tell me about the Knight of Swords. Eight of Pentacles, yep. Working on this, putting in effort. I'm going to make this happen. Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, yes. Very clear energy on your person's side here with this Knight of Swords. I think they want a second chance. What do we need to know about this person that Taurus is thinking about or dealing with right now? What are their thoughts or feelings towards Taurus? Oh my God, what's going on with my decks? I'm taking a risk, I feel trapped. I'm ready to take action. Please forgive me, we need to talk, okay. I think this person's taking a risk because they don't know how this is going to end up. I think in their mind, there's some, it's almost like this, um, I don't know, with the Seven of Pentacles reverse at the bottom of the deck here, it's almost like this person's taking a risk because in their mind, there's no hope to make this work out. Or, I don't know, it's like a, it's like they're going to give it one last try, hoping for the best, but expecting the worst, that kind of energy. What else do we need to know about this person? Bringing you a gift, hoping for a change. I don't know who this is, but this is for a Taurus that your person and, I don't know, you, you and your person are not on the same page. You want something, they want something, but it's not the same thing. What else do we need to know about this person? What else do we need to know about this person? What else do we need to know about this person? I stay up at night thinking of you. I stay up at night thinking of you. So they don't have access to you. You're not talking or you're not together. There's death that showed up itself again. Scorpio energy. So what are this person's true intentions towards you? What are their true intentions? Judgment reverse. What are their true intentions? What are their true intentions towards Taurus? Three of Wands reverse. Can I get one more? What are their true intentions? What are their next actions, actually? What are their next actions going to be? I think it's this Knight of Swords, like some sort of communication. Death. Seven of Pentacles reversed again. Five of Swords reversed at the bottom of the deck. Okay, 
I think this person wants to fix things, but with Judgment Reverse and the Three of Wands Reverse, they might jump in and try to do something like in a desperate way or in a way that doesn't work. I think their actions are tied to this ending, this change. It's like they don't want things to end or change here. Why is death here? Why is death here? You could also be dealing with a Scorpio or someone with Scorpio in their chart. Why is death here? Ten of Swords, Strength, and the High Priestess. The Hangman. Yeah, I feel like this person is trying to delay this, stop this, planning something about this in secret or like controlling the situation. I think they think they're running out of time. I think in their mind, this is like the la their last chance or they can smell or sense that what worked before is not going to work now. Tell me more about this person's intentions towards Taurus. But this is definitely about an ending. I'm talking to a Taurus that there's an ending or a change that has happened in their connection or will be ending soon. And for some reason, I think for a lot of you, Taurus, you're the one that initiated that ending. Tell me about this person's intentions. Oh yeah, the wolf. This person is motivated and there's the elephant, all about challenges and obstacles and overcoming a challenge or an obstacle. They're motivated to at least try. I think deep down they're hoping for success, you know, and maybe they're even deluding themselves into thinking like this can't end. Like there's no way that this can end. Oh my God, there's the coffin. <laughs> and I wanted to come out reverse. So it's almost like this person is thinking this can't end, literally. What I was just saying, <laughs> I'm going to delay this ending. I'm going to delay this. I'm going to stop this. And then there's that mature woman energy at the bottom of the deck. So I feel like this is almost, I'm thinking of the Empress, very Taurus energy. So Taurus, what I'm thinking is that this person is desperately thinking that they're going to be able to stop this. They're going to be able to change your mind or they're hoping to change your mind. So that's what I have for you, Taurus. I hope you enjoyed this bonus love reading. If you did, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will, see, I will be seeing you all hopefully in another video very soon. Take care.